Assalamu alaikum, good morning, subah bukhair, guten morgen from probably the most famous town in the whole Mosel Valley. If you search Mosel Valley, this place comes up. Uh, it's called Kochem, right in almost the middle of Koblenz and Trier. And let's see what Kochem looks like. First impression of the place is that it is very touristy. So it is around 10 a.m. and there's already a lot of people walking around. It is very medievalistic but definitely very touristic. The first place that I will go is called Pina Cruz. It's a cross, so I'm guessing that has something to do with the name. But it's an observational deck. Bit of a hike, so it wouldn't be a lot of people. But let's we'll start off from there. See the views of the city. So the Google has gone crazy. This is me. This is the destination. And apparently, according to Google, it will take 8 days and 3 hours to go. And it includes a boat ride. Hey, so Sasserbahn, you can take the chairlift up there. Apparently there will be a lot of people. Also, I might add not the perfect day to wear black. I'm wearing black shirt, black pants, black cap. And it is hot as bridge. Final Cruise offers the best views in the city. Some might argue that the Gofum Castle has better views, but I personally prefer this spot, mainly because you can see the castle as well from the distance, and you have the high ground here. Dragging my feet on an empty beach my heart is awake, but my brain is asleep, and I don't know. Water comes crashing onto my Just a little bit further ahead is the wildlife park with European animals and birds of prey. Plus, there are family rides and a cafe and a puppet theater. Ich war heute Morgen schon an der Tankstelle zu Fuß vier Tafeln und auf dem Rückweg sehe ich noch flott die Treppestufe in die Wirtschaftshuhe gesprungen und habe da noch ein Glas Schnäpschen hier drin. Da messe mich noch Rasen mit deinem Faulhaar, wenn du dir willst. All the love songs, all the love songs are wrong. All the love songs, all the love songs are wrong. You can see the capitalism when the beers have their own mansion and a swimming pool. Mr. Raccoon has a relatively small house. 
but the llama and the donkey have to share an apartment. They have reptiles here, snake, snakes and lizards in here. Don't they just crawl out? Hedwig is just chilling in his retirement home after Hogwarts got closed. All the love songs, all the love songs are wrong. Miss Ostrich has mastered the art of staying perfectly still for about 3 minutes but then I had to leave. You can hear the music. It was about 3 pm and you could see how crowded the streets of Koham can get, especially in the summer. There is a mustard museum with a rather difficult name that produces mustard using an old method of old grinding process. These are the pins for all the different people who have come to visit this museum. I am the second Pakistani. This is uh, my pin exactly. They are among the oldest mustard mills in whole Europe and you can also test the samples for different flavors. I kind of want to try this the Jewish curry scent. Wrightsburg Kokham. This is probably the place that I was most excited about before coming to Moselle and probably the only place that I knew about before coming to Moselle. And the thing is, look at that. You can already see it. It is a bit of a hike though. Dating back to about 12th century, Wrightsburg Kokham had a major control over the trade routes and passages along the Moselle River. The Castle House is a museum that can be visited on guided tours from March to November and the guided tours are in English as well. Being at such a strategic point in a pivotal time of history, they had bigger problems. Like whenever they would come back to their rooms, drunk at night, it was very difficult to find the keyholes to their doors. So they came up with a very easy solution. Always fall into the keyhole. That's a very easy solution. Also, the statues with the crests are lions, not frogs. This was mentioned many, many times. Oh, 
150 feet, about 50 meters. Just 50 meters. And the boat was normally it was 100 meters deep, so they were lucky to find it here. So you can throw some water downwards. It takes about five seconds, then we reach the bottom. Being a huge fan of lavish lifestyle and interior decorations, fake doors were added on the other side of the rooms for the sake of symmetry. But not all of these doors are fake, some lead to secret passages and rooms. There was even a library behind one of these hidden doors. To really get the medieval touch, you can sign up for the night's meal, which is hosted almost every week after the tour where you can enjoy the food and songs of the Middle Ages in a more traditional style. The tickets and schedules for all of these events can be found in their website and I will add that in the description as well. This concludes my third day in Moselle Valley. Hope you liked it. Take care, keep exploring, and I'll see you next time.